What is up guys? Razor here. And welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy 15. In the previous episode we did some rescue missions in Klein or Klein or however you pronounce the area. We did all the rescue missions in that area. So we're done with every rescue mission in the game except for one. And we're going to be doing that one in this episode. And we're also going to be doing the Broken Cars side quests as well. Starting with this one right here. I'm right here on the map. And we can give this guy a repair kit. Oh, thank goodness you're here. My car is stuck. Automotive agitation. What a relief. Thank you. So just like the rescue missions, there's ten uh, broken cars in each of the three areas. So Lead A, Dust Sky, and Klon. Or Klain, or however you pronounce it. Uh, we found seven broken cars earlier in Lydie, or however you pronounce the area. There you're at now. This area here. We found seven of them earlier in the game, like I said. We need to find three more. Oh, that was actually the eighth one right there. So now we need to find two more. And some of these aren't available until after you complete a certain chapter of the game or the main story. And some of them aren't available until after you've completed a certain quest as well. So how about a breather? All right, so this one should be around around this road right here, I would say. Let's call the chocobo. See if we can find him. Let's go. Nope, not the right way. I'll turn here. Oh, we should find them on the road, I would guess, near the road. How far are we going? Got plenty of time to figure it out. <laughs> going until we find someone broke down. That's where we're going. Gotta make sure to keep my eyes peeled. They're not always on the road either. Sometimes they're like off to the side or whatever. But it is a lot easier to see a car than it is to find a person. So really the broken car quests aren't as hard as the rescue ones. There's some right down here. Thanks for the ride. Aw, thanks buddy. Just my luck. I need to... Car Mike. Retribution. Finally, thanks for the help. 
That couldn't have gone any better. I guess we could take these things out while we're here. We haven't heard this battle theme in a while. Alright, the next one we have to go far to the south, uh, near Golden Quay. Oh, and I have the food buff that uh, depletes 25% less, or 20% less stamina on the Chocobo, by the way. Just to make this a lot easier. And this is the last uh, broken car we need to find in Lead A or Light A or however you pronounce it. Because like I said we completed seven, seven of them earlier so. We only had to we only had to find three of them, so easy enough. Yep, there he is, right there. It's the last one in this area. Oh, thank goodness you're here. I... Waiting for help. What a relief. I call that a job well done. All right, so that's all 10 in lead A or light A. Now, there is one rescue mission that we can do here, though, like I said. And that'll be the last rescue mission here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep, one more. So I'll go do that real quick, and I'll be right back. I'll just meet you at the person, that way you ain't got to see me look around for the person. Because sometimes they're hard to find. And then when I find the person, I'll show you where he's at on the map. He or she is out on the map. Because sometimes it's a female character and sometimes it's a male character who's lost. Oh, cool. I'm here at a time quest. I didn't even realize. I was coming up here to rescue somebody. And I realized I was at a time quest. So this is our first time doing one of these. Indeed. Meet again. Oh, we gotta fight a, some cactars here, as you can tell. Better to feed him as fast as I can. I don't know if I'll be able to beat him in time, but we'll try. Dang it. Oh, they're immune to the ring. And they're annoying. Wow, 
Wow, are you kidding me? Stop. I get Mega Phoenixes and stuff though. Wow. This is ridiculous. I can't even move because I keep getting knocked down. I guess you're supposed to use magic on these things. Because they like to group together like that. That's it. attacks are super overpowered because you can't move when they're hitting you with it. What kind of cheap sh stuff is that? I like the rewards for this but come on now. Also inflicts confusion too, which is also annoying. Dama girl on him. Screw it. Unreal. Sorry to break this I didn't mean to leave the zone. If I had a food buff, this would be a lot easier, but I didn't even have a food buff because I wasn't expecting to do this. some of the protect against confusion because that's what keeps screwing me up because they keep confusing me if I was more prepared for this I wouldn't have be having an issue because I would have bought like a food buff to increase my attack or something I wasn't planning on doing this.
Kind of makes me a little bit annoyed. It's petrification, toad. There we go, confusion. Use a mega potion, I guess, since they're dropping a bunch of those anyway. It's the prompto. Use the rocket launcher, I guess. And the grenade. I won't be a hit him with a machine gun, probably, but I'll try. They're too fast to hit with the machine gun. The rocket launcher works well. I gotta kill a hundred of these things too. They give you plenty of time though, so it's not a big deal. Just the regular attack does pretty good too. Alright, see, that's a lot less annoying when using Prompto. One false move and we're done for. We can turn the tide yet. Because you have all this AoE stuff. No quarter. I can keep my distance and stuff. I don't have to worry about getting hit with their needles. Well, I mean, I still get hit every now and then, but not as bad as it was with Noctis. Got a lot, you get a lot of mega potions for doing this and remedies and stuff like that. Yeah. <laughs> 
You're almost guaranteed to hit with that rocket launcher though. It does it has such a high ra ra radius when it when the blast goes off. So this the machine gun's useless against these things because they keep moving around. You have to be very good at shooting. Which some of you probably are, I'm not though. I was not prepared for this though. Wow, now it's starting to go after me. enough time I'll tell you that QP and exchange QP. All right, exchange QP for prizes from the main menu. All right. You also get a lot of EXP for that too. Wow. Right now, all I can get is a couple of Ascension coins and Mega Phoenix. Oh, 150,000 EXP! Wow. 300 AP. Hundred thousand gil. Five Mega Elixirs. Afro sword. This thing right here sells for a million gil. Uh, you can also, I think it's good for crafting spells too. I want to actually do that again because I want to get the EXP for that. Um, I need to find a campsite. Yeah, I'm gonna do that again. I'm not gonna show it. I'm not gonna show me doing it again, though. I'm just gonna show it one time. Easy to sleep with civilization nearby. Um, wrong with the outdoors, but, but I do want to do it again because of the amount of EXP I got from that. It's pretty good. And I want to get double the double that. Camping. Oh, by camping, eating the double exp food.
All right, so I got the food buff, and I was going to take on that time quest again, but I found the hunter. When you believe. So let's go ahead and see if we can find him. Yeah, I'll do that later. We'll definitely be doing the Menace of the Deep later. That might be the last thing we do. Right now I want to find this guy. There he is. Alright, so this is the final rescue mission that we have to do. We've done all of them now. All in a day's work. And just to show you. Oh, there's the time quest. Yeah, just to show you. Let's go to quest here. And we can count. Alright, so... This starts the clean ones. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And that's all for clean. Now for dust guy, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And now for lie day or however you pronounce it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So there you go. That's all the rescue missions in the game. We still have to do the broken cars. But like I said, I'm going to do this time quest again. And I'll be right back when it's over. All right, I'm back, and I huh. took part in the time quest <clears throat> over ten times. I'm not, to, I'm not sure the exact amount I did it, but I completed it a lot. And I grew some levels as well. As you can tell, we're up to level 104, and then prompt is level 105. So, there you go. So... Now we're going to head to Clane and complete some more Broken Cars side quest. So we need to head up here. There's one person up here. There's only three of them that we got to do in Clane and that'll be it for this episode. In the next episode I'll do uh, Dust Guy. And then we'll be done with all the broken cars after that. And then literally all I have to do after that is... Um... The... Um... What is it called? The... I can't even think of what it's called. The... Menace of the Deep or whatever. Which is going to take forever to complete all that, all, every one of them dungeons. But such is the way of things. Luckily we got the ring, I can... Day for a walk, huh? <clears throat> I can get to the missile deep quite quickly with the ring. So, shouldn't be that bad.
We're getting the vehicle. And no one to hold us back. Go ahead and turn around and go this way. I'm not 100% sure where the person's at, but... I think he's like right around in here somewhere. So I have to keep an eye out for car. So I'm trying not to go too fast. I thought that was a car, it's a rock. <laughs> That's the perfect theme song for this area. Oh, there he is. Out. We found him. Oh, thank keep calm and keep driving. What a All in a day's work. I'll be glad to get all these side quests done. These side quests are so tedious. I'm not sure whoever at Square Enix thought that was a good idea to put all these all these random side quests in here. It's just like unnecessary. Maybe I'm crazy though. Maybe people like that stuff. I don't know. I'm not sure. It just doesn't seem like something that people would like to do, but maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm the only one who doesn't like these type of side quests. I don't know. I haven't really looked up how people feel about them. Anyway, we got two more to find, and we'll be done with Clayne and Ledi, or however you pronounce it, Letty. I have no clue how to pronounce it. Could really use a car wash. And then we'd best stop at the nearest petrol station. Sometimes you'll find the people right next to the parking spots too. Uh, but I think this person's actually down this way. Here we go. Might as well get in the vehicle. <laughs> Get 
Then I'm keeping it nice and slow in case I, I can keep an eye out. Everybody out. I shouldn't get out here because there's a treasure we can get. I think I'll go out on foot from here on out. Let's see. It might be out that way. Go this way. He must not be by the road because I didn't see him. Like I said, they're not always out on the road. They're usually near the road, but no. Well, I guess we can pick up treasure that we find. Take a nap. Too bad. Hmm. I'm not sure where the person's at, to be honest. I know he's out around somewhere around here. Let's go back this way. Or let's go this way, I mean. Sometimes it's fun, hard to find these people. I don't see any vehicles at all though. Strange. At least I'm finding drops, I guess.
Yeah, it's taking too long to find him, so I'll just cut the video here until I find him. And I'll be right back. Alright, I found the person, as you can tell, right here on the map. I was basically in the wrong direction. And the guy that I was following was a little bit off on where he was located, but whatever. Oh, thank goodness you're here. Alone on the road. What a relief. Thank you. I call that a job well done. Okay, and the next person we need to find it's probably around here somewhere, it looks like. <clears throat> uh, get our way, make our way back to the vehicle. Oh crap, I didn't know the vehicle's way over there. Alright, I'll just hit return to car then. Just gonna auto over here. Nice weather. Oh, great, it's night time. It's going to make it more difficult. For sure. Alright Imperials, thanks for the light though, I appreciate it. You mind staying up there for a while? Are they going to drop anything or what? Oh, they already did. Alright, so I know it's going to find, take me a while to find this next person as well, so I'll just go ahead and cut the video here to save you guys some time of me running around trying to find this person. So I'll bear it back whenever I f find him.
All right, I'm back, and as you can tell, I found the person. Let's go ahead and give them the repair kit. And this is the final broken car quest in Clane, or however you pronounce the area, Clane, Klein. I don't even know. Ooh, that couldn't have gone any better. Driver in despair. And with that, we have completed all the clean ones and all the the ID uh, lead. I have no clue how to pronounce that. But yeah, we completed all the broken car quests in this area. And... see this area clean Klein. I don't even know how to pronounce that either but in the next episode we'll do the dust sky so that'll be what we do in the next episode so we'll find the broken cars in dust sky so thank you guys for watching stay tuned for the next episode and later